All right, what's up, guys? So, uh, NHPK, they have uploaded a video titled 900 Horsepower BMW M4 Competition Competition 2020. I don't know why, because I was like, I I play the Settle Chords of Competizione, and I was about to say that, but I had to, like, stop myself and say, hold up, wait a minute, time out. <laughs> it's competition. <laughs> but uh, 2021, Forza Horizon 5, steering wheel gameplay, bruh. I'm telling you guys, for well, at least for Forza, I can't control the car for crap. So maybe I just got to play more of it. But um, no, get you a steering wheel controller for racing games. No, they uh, there's some games there. It's like they support it. Um, Assetto Corsa Competizione. I know it supports the one that I have. Like it just really depends because I had got the uh, Logitech um G923, so it's like the latest one. So I don't think there's some games that fully supports it. So I think maybe like if you get like a G920, uh, I think that that was like the yeah that came out like some years ago. So it's like it may be a little bit more better to manage on um uh like you know games and stuff. It's like one and the same. It ain't much of a difference between them two controllers. It's literally like the iPhone 13 and iPhone 14. There's not much of a difference. So I guess if you see the G920. I mean, I don't know, like, if you want to get the latest one, because there'll probably be in a matter of time where they're all like, oh, this can, um, steering wheel controller is no longer supported, but the G923, so yeah, it's probably best, but I think you'll just have to, like, tweak the settings for some games that you play, but I know for a fact, Grit Legends, um, steering wheel controllers work for that, uh, Forza, but it's kind of like off, a Settle Corsa Competition, I think there are some other games where it, um, works okay, but, uh, yeah, with Forza, I had to, like, get me a D-Class car and, like, drive extra slow with it in order for me to, like, not spin out and lose control and stuff. But, anyways, I know that new, then there is, uh, that new, um, rally game, Dakar Desert, oh, Dakar Desert Rally, Dirt Rally 2.0, um, yeah, so, yeah, there's, there's some games out there that works, but, anyways. I'd be liking to watch some videos like this from time to time. That's a nice BMW, though. I might have to cop that. Dudes really be, like, you know, driving with this. Because me, on the other hand, I'm like, I'm just... I don't got, like, the whole rig set up like that. I have mines, like, on my table. And then just, you know, underneath, of course, like, the steering wheel. I had to, actually had to buy a smaller... Or, yeah, small table for the, uh, um, the gear and stuff, so... But it comes with like the the pads. Yeah, I think it's, yeah he's using his. So it's so fun though playing this. Like when I'm not spinning out and losing control and stuff. So he's more controlled with his driving because it's it's super sensitive, man. He got the whole handbrake. Dang. I didn't even see the handbrake at first. I, that's like, honestly, because I was like, the one game that I um, was going to try to play was uh, Car X Drift Racing Online. And I'm like, no, nah, a handbrake is needed. It's like, you have to get a handbrake for that car or for this uh, um, game. But it's fun, though, like watching uh, people play this. Dang. Is that Ford GT really chasing him? It's like, homie, I don't want to race you. I just want to beat to myself. Like, look, it's like people people really drive like that. Look, crash. Exactly what you get. Trying to pass up people. See? I just think that was like a, a Dodge Dart. It's like one of them like classic, um, the old, old ones. I think that was a Dodge Dart. It looked like it. It could have been some. I just only can tell, like, because there's, like, I think every time when they do have, like, that old-fashioned Dodge Dart in the game, it's always, like, that classic, like, old look to it. But yeah, I was like, I know when I was, uh, when I very first got my steering wheel controller, I started playing a Seto Corza, uh, Competizione, and oh my god, like, I ended up switching and just playing, like, Grit Legends, but, because it's a little bit more easier to control the cars in there, I was just looking something for more, like, of a, 
easier like um play to it versus a Sailor Corza. It's like nah, you really gotta like know some stuff. I mean, it was good though. Like I don't get me wrong. Like I I did like the controls in there. It did like teach you more and stuff with the uh, racing, but yeah, it was just man, the homie drifting and stuff. I lost control at some point. <laughs> Crashed into that car. Drove all off on the side. That Ford GT again. I might download Forza. <laughs> I just like seeing this and it motivated me to like play the game. Actually like practice with the steering wheel controller and stuff. But I think like once when I like, maybe like I get like a bigger table or something or get like a racing rig. Um, go and uh, actually like get like the uh, handbrake. No, people are all like that's like one i think once the um time i was see like talking to somebody on twitch and uh they were saying how like they don't really be playing racing games because it's boring and i'm like bro you guys y'all gotta watch videos like this you see somebody playing with a racing rig it's like it's literally having like and i remember somebody saying that but it's literally like having one of them like arcades in your house And I'm like, man, it, you know, it freaking, it's fun. Then you got the people out there that spend like sixteen to thirty thousand dollars. Cause I think T Pain, he got like, he got like a freaking a uh, Universal Studios ride in his house. Homie got like a setup where it's like that it moves along with the car and stuff. This is T Pain, the the R&B singer that was talking about buying drinks back when we were in elementary. That guy. That, this is how I race. I race with the uh, um, first person view. At least I'm like playing, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, Grid, Grid Legends. I know there was a one video they showed in these bodybuilders. They had put like the force feedback all the way up to. I can't remember what settings they put it all the way up to, but they showed them guys cannot. It, it was, they were sweet. It looked like they were just finished working out. Homies was like, one dude was like three of me put together. He could not, he could not control that steering wheel. Some them steering wheels, depending on which one you get, it can be really strong. I feel like that would be a good workout though like like if I was a professional racer and stuff I just you know because I think they do have like some exercise where they had to like st um turn the steering wheel and stuff back and forth so I think it's like them F1 drivers be doing that yeah it's like you could just do this for hours like if i hadn't beat um forza because i think that's like one of the main reasons why dang they always do that crap but that's like one of the main reasons why i really don't play it as much um now because i had beaten it already not beaten it prior before i had got my uh gaming pc and my steering wheel controller so it was like going back i don't know maybe well i know they did come out with that hot wheels dlc and stuff but I know definitely with this uh, Forza Motorsports, I will be playing that. I definitely will be playing that. I'm like, I don't care if I be spinning out and losing control. I'm just going to have to practice. Practice makes perfect.
Oh, he has to be playing on um, which call it uh, PC. Cause no, I was looking. I was like, wait a second. He has a. It didn't even. We're seven minutes into this video. It didn't even dawn to me that he's using the PlayStation control. I was like, whoa, wait a second time. Like, so I just don't want to get people that confusion. And I don't know. Maybe he um, did discuss it in other videos. But you will have to, in order to play Forza Horizon 5, like, you will have to, um, with either a PlayStation. So, like, let's say, for an example, you go to the store. They don't have Xbox, um, controllers, but they have, um, PlayStation controllers. Are you thinking, it ain't gonna work on your Xbox. You will have to have, like, a gaming PC of some sorts and things. I, you know, just in case those that, that didn't know. But it will work in that, um, fashion, too. Like, where you can play Forza Horizon 5 with it. Because on PC, they don't care. But, yeah, with the Xbox, it's like... Yeah, it's gonna matter, so. It's weird, they look exactly the same, but it's like if you plug in a PlayStation, like a regular PlayStation controller into your uh, Xbox. Unless you have like some adapter or some sort where you can switch it over. I don't, I don't know if that will work, but it's just best to, you know, get what you got. But it's, it's weird how I can play this game. I can play it with a normal controller, no problem. Steering wheel controller? Oh, my God. This is, like, one of the first games I played. And then it was like, no, you need, like, the setup. You need, like, a handbrake. You need, uh, um, yeah, you just, you need that stuff, man. I mean, also, like, practice and things. Like, don't give up like I did. I played this game maybe, like, two, three times. And I was like, nope. <laughs> Ain't set myself up for failure. I'm like, I'm... Having a good day today, I'm like, I ain't even trying to go through all that. They all just lined up, just having fun and stuff, like... And you just come back home after a, a long drive. know let the let the fam know that you home and things yeah forza it's one of those games where it's like it forza horizon 5 was really good like this um i mean just overall like playing all the different missions i mean the story is pretty basic it's like you know you're just a professional racer but um no it's it's good and things i mean judging by this video it's like yeah you can see how good the game is but yeah, it's like, that was that was a good video. I enjoyed that. It's just, you know, it gives me a reason. Like, you know what? Maybe I should give Forza Horizon 5 another chance and things. I should see about playing Forza Horizon 4. See how that works and stuff. But regardless, anyways, make sure if you guys haven't, go subscribe to NHPK for more videos like this. Show love, show support. Like, subscribe to me too, and I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching, and peace.